Hello. This build I also did in February of 24 is titled Modern Home. It's around $86,000, 40 by 30 lot, four bedroom, four bath. This puts new meaning to open floor plan. Unique, spacious, modern home has four bedrooms, each with their own bath, plus three half baths on the main floor. Each room has its own outdoor access complete with walkways and has a beautiful central garden. Sims can get through as I checked. Minor landscaping to add a little curb appeal. Decor is up to you and your creativity as this is already a pricey home. And if you use it, do all those things. A quick peek here. See how that's all open? There's trees and stuff in there. Got a lot of, um, I keep wanting to call them sunroofs. They're not sunroofs, skylights glass ceilings, things like that. Downstairs, upstairs. Let's go check it out. See what I did. I kind of like this one. I was proud of myself for this one because I was trying to do new different things. Something that was outside of the normal box like this one. Um, so you can see you've got glass roof on all four sides or all the way through the middle there you got the glass roof in the front got the walkways out here so it's all open nice airy i do love that so much I, I, I'm, kind of, I'm still kind of proud of me for this one so yeah there's your bedrooms each with their own bath and it looks like living kitchen dining office so let's go check it out well, we'll do it this way because I think it'll be easier. So here's the center garden area. Looks like you've got four staircases with the glass railings. And I did check to make sure that the Sims could walk through here in any which way. They can walk around, in and out and around and backwards and forwards. And looks like I didn't do... Okay, yeah. So instead of having to leave here, go through here and up here to get over there... You can just use these ladders inside. I think maybe you don't have to use those. But I figured that way, like if you're down here and you need to go to the bedroom up here, you can just, instead of taking the stairs to come up, which you can, you can just take the ladder and go straight up. I don't know why I thought that was a good idea. I guess you don't really have to do that because you do have these stair railing or staircases, so you could just not. Um, but I do like how it looks. I like the little courtyard area. You could change it up a little bit. Um, you could even have like gardening area over here off to the side. This is the main entryway, which is gonna be the living room with the TV and fireplace. And you've got an outside access door here and your half bath there so that way and I think that's why I did a half bath in each of the basement rooms or main floor rooms so that you wouldn't have to go from here all the way over here or upstairs to go to the bathroom so you can do it you can do it you can go to the bathroom in each room if you have to if you need to shower you need to go up into your room um, but if you go out this way you can take the little walkway and go up and around <clears throat> or if you need to get to here, you can just go through the courtyard and go through this door. And that's your office area. Got a little seating area here with your chessboard, half bath, bookcases, all that. Dining room. Again, you just come out and go in through here. And it's a very basic, not a lot going on in here. Not, no, no, there's no decor because like I said, it's already an expensive home. I didn't want to add to it. Plus... Each of your Sims have their own unique likes and dislikes, so that way you can decorate it as to what they want. And then for the kitchen, you just come, here's the door to the kitchen here. So you have a little breakfast nook over there, half bath, and then your kitchen, which I really do like this kitchen. It's very modern, very sleek. The floor isn't very modern, but I also didn't have a lot of packs at the time. I think I only had the base game still and the occasional debug um, and then if we go upstairs each room all the rooms are connected by the walkways basically so you can go from this bedroom to this bedroom and 
all the way around. You can visit all the bedrooms you want until you decide to go down one of the stairs. But each one has a full bath, its own little ladder downstairs, which again, you can probably get rid of that. So it's a little bit more private. Because if you're here and somebody's cooking in the kitchen, in reality anyway, somebody's cooking in the kitchen, you're gonna smell whatever they're cooking from this little hole. And you know, if you're cooking fish, fish does tend to smell things up quite a lot. But if you're popping popcorn, that's a smell I'd like to smell. I love the smell of popcorn, buttered popcorn. Very, very, very buttered popcorn. But again, the walls aren't even painted. You still have the concrete floors upstairs. Downstairs, it's just basic wall paint and basic flooring. So yeah, you'll probably wanna change that. But again, it's up to your Sims likes. But I will say the way, the way, the way this looks from the exterior is probably my favorite thing. With the center courtyard, I keep calling it a courtyard, I don't know if it is or not, but this little center courtyard and the glass ceilings up here, I think is just beautiful. Because even though you may have to go outside to go from the bedroom to the dining room over here, yes you're outside but you are covered on all aspects so even if it's raining or snowing or whatever the rain and snow will never get down underneath and your sims will be covered now if you have seasons or whatever i think it's seasons that makes your sims get too hot or too cold and and die from it um i don't think that's going to change if you're out here on the veranda or whatever you want to call this, the walkway. Um, I think you can, your Sims can still be affected by that, but at least you won't get wet <laughs> or snowed on. So anyway, if you decide to use this one, do let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think about it. Let me know if you like it or not, what you would change. If you did change it, let me know where to find it on the gallery. I'll go check it out. Leave your comments of any other kind. Just be kind please. And uh, until next time, y'all just have fun.